What's going on guys? Welcome back to the video. In today's video, we have some serious news. Apparently, these guys by the name of Wish Games actually came out with a Nostalgia Sonic Speed Simulator, which that's really cool. So we're gonna be playing it and we're gonna be seeing how nostalgic it is. So I'm gonna be scaling on a one to 10. But before we hop in the game, thank you to Hedge for the video idea. I would have not found that game without him. So let's jump right into it. And all right guys, we're in the game and um, uh, it's a little finicky like with the camera and stuff but okay so as you can see i guess we have the child vending machines over here we can unlock amy and tails we have the worlds over here okay i mean like this is not too too bad and apparently there's a vent down here oh it's the treasure hunter knuckles event and we have to collect 1000 emerald shards and 400 rings which that's kind of easy all right guys i kind of want to try something so if we go to the shop and we try to redeem let's see if we can get rider sonic so what we have to do we have to type in riders all capitals and if we click redeem let's see if we got him all right we're gonna go to menu and um uh yeah i didn't get him like at all what the heck and there's a bunch of worlds so we're gonna go check those out later but for right now i say let's just try to level up 12 seconds later hold on if my memory serves me correct yeah there's a vending machine up there so let's go try to get it all right guys and just like that yes we made it up here let's see what shower Oh, so, but why are these chow in here? That's not really realistic. I thought these chow were not even, all these chow were not even OG. Whoa, okay, so we're inside of Sandy Hill, and there's another vending machine right there. Oh, yeah, no, this is really OG, even with the, the shards. Oh, and there's, what, what are those rings doing right there? Dude, Sandy Hills is exactly like it was before, and I'm pretty sure there's a Tails card right here, if I'm not mistaken. Two very boring minutes later. Whoa, wait, why am I going out of bounds? Wait, what the heck? I guess I can go out of bounds, which is cool. All right, guys, let's try to go to Emerald Tail. Let's see if there's anything in there. All right, guys, we made it to Emerald Tail, and, uh, yeah, dude, this is so OG. Again, though, I don't think these chow were in Emerald Tail, but, like, I still think it's whatever. Dude, this is, like totally og oh my god yeah, the little grind rail was over there dude i must think it was yesterday dude, oh my gosh look at this yeah dude it's just so og wait let's see that vending machine still up there well all right guys for some reason i can't even get up there but i guess let's go to snow valley but before we go to snow valley i think we should put on knuckles all oh, right and we're in the snow valley obviously they brought back the obbies i kind of like how they removed them but at the same time i kind of wish like you were just like a separate game mode all right we're gonna hit the spring oh we're almost there oh Oh, wait, when you fall down, you don't die anymore. I guess that's kind of cool. And it's like this, we're in Snow Valley. All right, guys, and we're in Snow Valley. And I mean, like, Snow Valley was kind of a mid-zone, to be honest. And everything's still kind of the same. Yeah, to be honest, there's not really much here. Obviously, it's still a good zone. And I'm pretty sure this is where the portal was supposed to be for the next zone. But honestly... It's not too, too bad, but it's not, like, the best. All right, let's go back in Green Hill, and let's see what I think of the game. Well, all right, guys, now here are my honest thoughts, and to be honest, I think this game, it's, it has a lot to improve on. Like, for some reason, like, look at the camera, right? I can zoom all the way out, and I can even play in first person, which is a little weird. Like, in the OG game, wasn't there, like, little cards that spawned, like, every five minutes, you have to collect them? And not to mention, I don't know where, like, the chests are. Like, in OG Sonic Speed Simulator, you would be able to unlock chests every, like, couple minutes. Or is it just me? But I feel like these Chow didn't, were not in the game, game, like, originally. Like, especially these, like, Ninja Chow. Like, they were not in OG Sonic Speed Simulator. But all in all, I do think it's a fun experience. And I don't think it's too, too nostalgic. Like, don't get me wrong. It is nostalgic. But it's not, like, heavily nostalgic. And do I think this game is better than sonic speed simulator definitely not even though nostalgia is kind of on my side i think it needs to hit some more key factors of nostalgia to make me like it more well, all right guys those were my honest thoughts in the game and here are the winners from the last video remember guys before i show the character on the screen if you have a longer answer like these people on the screen that means you'll have a more of a chance to be getting a shout out in my next video well anyways i'm gonna be showing up a sonic speed simulator skin on the screen if you guys get it correct i'll be getting three of you guys a shout out in my next video if you guys enjoyed the video make sure to like subscribe subscribe bell and i'll be seeing you guys in the next one peace thanks for watching